Hello, we are going to go over lesson 5-2 today. So 5-1, we went with our hundreds charts to subtract. Now we are going to be subtracting on an open number line. So remember, an open number line means that there's no numbers on it. You can create that number line. So our first problem is 82 minus 62. So I'm so you can either add, because remember, you can think addition to help you subtract, or you can just subtract. So first I'm going to show you how to subtract with it. Then I can show you how you can add to be able to figure out your number two. So first I'm going to start at the number 82. Now I'm going to jump back 10. I'm going to land on 72. Now I'm going to jump back 10 more. 62. And that's our answer. So we jump back 10 right here and 10 right here, and 10 plus 10 equals 20. So now I'm going to show you how you could do it with addition. You could start at 62, so you're going to want to start with your lowest number, and then you can jump forward until you land on 82. So 62, you can count by 1s, you can count by 10s, you can count by 5s, 2s, whatever is easiest, so I'm at 62, jump 10 forward to 72. Now I'm gonna jump 10 more forward to 82. And look at that, I just used addition to be able to figure out what my subtraction problem was. So 10 plus 10, again, equals 20. All right, let's go to our next one, 75 minus 19. So I am going to start at sep ah. 75 on the number line. So here's my 75. Now I'm going to jump back by tens. So 75, 65, 55, 45. 35, 25, and the next one is 15, but you know that you can't go to 15 because your number is 19. So now I'm going to start counting back by one. So I'm at 25, 24, 23, 22, 21, 20. 19. So there we go. We landed on 19. So now I'm going to count up all of these jumps that I made. So we have 10, 10, 10, 10, 10. And now we have ones that we just made one. All right, now let's count them all together. So we have 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56. So 75 minus 19 equals 56. And you can also think addition with that one. You could have started at 19. You could have jumped by 10s forward and then jumped by 1s to get to 75, and you could have figured out your answer also. All right, and last but not least, 59 minus 45. I'm going to start at 59 on my number line. Now I'm going to jump back 10. 49. Now I know that I can't jump back 10 because that's going to give me 39, and that's lower than 45. So now I have to start jumping by one. So I'm at 49, 48, 47, 46, 45. So now let's go ahead and count our humps. So we have one, 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 and then we have a 10 right here. So 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, so 59 minus 45 equals 14. 
So remember, with these open number lines, I always start with the biggest number and go back. I start by tens and then start counting by ones. Or if you don't like doing that, you can always start with the lowest number and you can count on to help you think addition while you subtract. I hope this helped. Thank you guys.